Assalamu alaikum guys, what's up? This is Muhammad Rihan Islam from Raj Experts. So today we are going to show you an amazing AI model that will be used to swear faces in your photos and videos as well. So let's get started without wasting any time. link to the collab uh, in the YouTube description as well and if you don't find the link in the YouTube description you can just simply go to github.com slash slump and then just go to repositories and you will see a repo here the notebook file just simply click on the open in collab <coughs> so just simply after opening it you to go to the runtime and run out uh, and click on the run all and this is just a simple warning you can ignore it just click on run anyway and as i have too many sessions already active i have to kill any previous session terminate other sessions and now click on run all make sure you are getting t4 here when you are uh, about to run it uh, as i have saved it with the ipy nb file either you can go to the edit section and go to notebook settings and just click python 3 and t4 gpu and click on save and then run time and run all and let me just explain you uh, this is just simply we are cloning the repo uh, the official repo that we are going to use it's called root it's a deep fake library that is used to swap faces and then after just cloning it as you can see the content here uh, we have just and then after changing the directory we are just simply installing all the requirements in the requirement.txt file this will install all of the requirements required to run the model and we are just downloading the model from the hugging face it's uh, just an online website where a lot of people host different kind of models and a lot of things and uh, then we are just creating a, a directory named models and then we are just simply moving the model into the models folder that we have created before after it uh, we are giving a gpu support uh, we are just simply uninstalling the own and next runtime and then we are installing the torch vn and torch audio first that is used to load the model uh, the uh, ins swapper on an x and then after it we have to install the own and next runtime gpu again to boost up the our environment so that the model can be used efficiently more efficiently and then after this we have just simply to run the defake section core is just simply using the python and then running the run.py file and it's have too much arguments like one is the target the target face we are going to use and the source face we are going to use and minus o as a output like where we are going to save the output in the content swap.mp4 uh, if you are using any video or something like that uh, then we will use mp4 either we will use uh, jpg or something like that and then we are providing it execution provider CUDA uh, it's actually mean that we are asking the python to run inside the uh, CUDA CUDA mean uh, it's a GPU based familiar devices so that our code run more fastly and efficiently and then if we are processing the video we will go through frame processor uh, so it will process every frame and then face swapper for face swapping and then uh, additional uh, parameter face enhancer to enhance the face so let's wait until all of these libraries are being installed and i will get back all right now you can see after waiting for five to seven minutes all the processing have been done and now just we have to simply upload our picture let's go to my drive and let me select a picture it is my clear picture it just gives you a simple warning that uh, after uploading your photo it will be deleted when the runtime is closed so be aware so let's download this sample demo picture and upload it as well go to upload right click in the here section and then choose show desired photo in which you want to replace the face and this is my source photo okay so I'm gonna give copy the path and give it here if your uh, picture have something name like this you have to type it in the inverted commas and this is our 
target picture and I will use the inverted comma here as well and I will let it know to save it here with the name swap.jpg and now run it just simply click on hit in the source section we will give our original image the face which we have to be swap and in the target image we have to give the image in which we want the face to be swap so the target image will be our target image in which the swap from this picture will be swapped here let's wait for some time and the AI model will replace the face okay uh, now we just simply have to click on the refresh and here is our down swapped image we can see uh, it's has swapped the image with my face okay and if you want to try any any other image we can try that as well so we have an, another image uh, we will test it on okay just simply download the image and upload it uh, and if we click go to download and upload the image uh, just simply copy the part and replace it in the section okay there we go and this is our source image and we will write swap 2 here so it will be saved with another name okay and it will probably take uh, under one minute to swap the face it will detect the landmarks on our face and landmark on the other photo to swap the faces on both okay as you can see the cell have finished in 31 seconds processing to image succeed now just simply refresh and you will see the new file here just simply double click on it and also you can download it by this download button right click here and as you can see it's very look similar to my face and same vice versa you can also download any videos and use them just simply okay just simply put the video in the upload section where uh, our files are being loaded and let's wait for it to finish we will just simply copy the file part place it here in the target section okay and in the source section our main image our face and here we will write mp4 as we want a video just simply click on run and it will start processing the video and setting the face on each frame it's converting the video to the 30 frame per second so that it can easily swap the face on each frame uh, the timing depends on the video size as our video is uh, might be a bit lengthy so it might take some time so wait patiently okay as you can see the face swapping have been done now it's uh, enhancing the faces so that it's look realistic and i think it's have created 458 frames from the whole video and processing 9 frames per second at average rate and now it's enhancing the whole of the frames of the video uh, one frame per second so it's using uh, 5 gigabit of memory and let's wait what it's done and after waiting for six minutes uh, the video processing have been done and it's have uh, created the video with 30 frames per second restoring audio might cause issues as fps not kept cleaning temporary resources and blah blah and just simply hit is our video if you don't get the video of images just simply click on the refresh button and download the video swap to dot mp4 that's our the latest file uh, here we go. Let's open it up and see what's the result. Where is Indiki ka so late chatte wato? And you can see it says swab the face. As there is two faces, it swab it with the one, and the other look really, really near to me. As you can see, it's very close. Let's Where is let Indiki ka play it chapte? again. It's did to look look like me. It's same i'm just totally amazed with the technology 
so on in the next video bye bye thank you very much thank you for watching don't forget to like subscribe my channel and give some style on the github and bye bye thank you